What up, Posse? I'm here at Heroic Goods and Games, a local Minneapolis uh, toy store, video game store, comic book store, a little bit of everything. And let's go, as you can tell from the front of the building, they're gonna have a lot of cool things. So let's see what they got. Mm, tick, nice. 100 bullets. A lot of good comics here. Yeah. New stand time machine. Let me pick this up. <laughs> nice, look at these. Nice toy biz, bring home the action. So spawn. I have all these, I think. I might need 22. Spider-Man 2099. Some awesome graphic novels, Creature Sandman, and some board games. Some Dungeon and Dragon stuff, some dice, starter kit. Pokemon, Jurassic Park, Spinal Tap. 
Top Gun, Kindergarten Cup, Raiders of the Lost Ark, and Movie 2. Oh, here are some Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Goodness here. Let's see. Star 99, not bad. This is my favorite VHS. The whole series. Some more graphic novels, some saga. Nice. Here you go. Uh, another VHS. Some Disney Black Diamond. Hey Paul, how's it going? Hello. I definitely want to sit down with a quick little interview after I'm done doing a walkthrough. I gotta go hunt for something. Oh, okay. I'll be right back. All right. Some Dragon magazines, Man magazines, Nintendo Power, Super Mario Brothers. Ooh. Thing. Nice. Battles of the Beyonder. There's too many. I'm going to do them all. Seems like you got a lot of anime, action, cartoons. And the zoo is. Uh, some manga video games. Ooh, Wolfenstein 2. Super Nintendo in box, Pit Boy, some Smurfs glassware. Some Xbox and sixty games. PlayStation games. Yes. I know, right? Nice. 
Super Nintendo. Some mitten box games. Man, this looks pretty good. Nice. Twenty four ninety nine, not bad. Sticker looks good. Three stages. Some amiibos. Excuse me, sorry. Sorry. It's okay. Could be a good Star Wars. Here you go.
Paul. I do have a question. What's up? On your website, you had a Yoda fleet. Do you still have one? Yes. <laughs> awesome. But he's hiding. That's totally fine. Because I, uh, I want it. But not hiding that deep, so. Okay. There's some I got. I got photos of them, but I didn't get them in their little okay. plastic packages. And I'm pretty it's like sure I hope it's still here. here. He's got his walking stick. And Let's look. There he is. Got all his little pieces. I mean, yep. I have one, but he's missing the damn stick. <laughs> I looked online, and a real one is like 60 bucks. Yes, the, buying them separate is worse. Is like the same as getting them. So it was like with. Might as well buy it man on card then if you're gonna piece it out. I, Sometimes. There's accessories, man. Well, I'll definitely take it. I'm sweet. <laughs> yes, finally. I think I'll have to pick these up for my girlfriend Emily. Great. Ooh, Mazda, nice. I didn't even know that was a game. I bought a collection of Oh, nice. Did I did. They had it in Yep, absolutely. Yeah, empty box. Yeah, Cards. Some green. My eye on that static shock. Whoa, fancy. We got a male. X Force, yeah, Deadpool, yeah. Charizard, Night Caller. September 25th. Cool. Let's see if they're around. Too close, yeah, it's pretty good. No free tickets inside. Last year I got or two years ago. All right, hey guys, we're here with Paul, who's the owner of Real Goods and Games. So how long has the store been open? About four years? Yeah, we just hit four years on Thursday, July 1st. Nice. So, and which is also our first day back to in-store shopping. So now we That's have- That's awesome. Uh, we kind of, we, uh, at the front end of the pandemic, we had a new website, so we did curbside pickup and shipping, but now you can do the curbside pickup and shipping yeah. as well as shopping store again. Okay, and the online shopping's been like a lifesaver, right? It was the awesome. Pandemic. Yeah. Yep, it, people were really supportive. Um, it helped that we had cool stuff to sell. So yeah, <laughs> but, that helped. Uh, and, and you guys started getting like ha getting hardcore into the trading card game. We got a lot of non-sports trading yeah. cards. I remember the, uh, like you started, like you had some, but not a lot. Like when you were open before the pandemic, but yep. now it's like this is like a spot to grab oh, so Pokemon fun. packs. Yep. And, um, do you do like wrestling too, or just mainly Star Wars? Um, and... We have we have gotten some wrestling, but it's mostly sold. We're currently sold out because it's been that hot. So yeah, we exactly. will though. Like the future top sets, we'll we'll get some of them. Okay, some of the chromes and stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay, but they are now. Uh, yeah, for better or worse, very hard yes. to get. Yes, so. and will you be doing like card breaks? I've seen that become kind of like a really popular we've, we've thing. We've done over a the couple, pandemic. but we've only done it to film for our own singles, and then like put them like as you see, we got oh, some yeah, of the yeah. case here. Uh -huh. But the coolest ones we've got. There we, here's a uh, Chris Evans autograph. Oh yeah, that one's nice. a really sweet. I don't know if you can see the number, but it's 11 out of 25. Oh, so that's nice. all, and that's yeah. all he signed for the set. And so the that's, Infinity Saga, so that's awesome. Yep, that one was. We got some wax Marvel. packs here. Oh yeah, we got duck. more to put out, but we'll get yeah. there. And then, um, so kind of, what made you? want to open a story have you, you just oh, been a lifelong collector you know i've always i've worked a lot of retail before and yeah. it was kind of a goal of mine so oh, okay um, awesome yeah it's always since i was very young was on the radar of opening an antique store which i don't think many seventh graders are like oh, i'm gonna open an antique yeah everyone's store. like i want to be uh, like an astronaut i'm <laughs> yeah. gonna open an antique store <laughs> but we got there so yes. um yeah and this and, is awesome you got everything from comics video games board games dungeon and dragons yeah the Crazy. the combo has been really good uh to yeah. us i'm um, just kind of having something um by having kind of the range, if yeah. an entire family comes in, everyone's gonna have something they want to hunt for and look for in our store. Gotcha. And if people want to find you on social media, is it all Heroic Goods and Games? Yep, it's either all Heroic Goods on Instagram and Twitter, it's Heroic Goods and Games on Facebook, um, and the website's HeroicGoodsAndGames.com. And you do out. curbside, do you also ship out, or is it just? Yep, we do free shipping um, okay. if you spend over 100 and uh, across America, and um, we will ship worldwide as well. Okay, awesome. Hey, right, thank you, Paul. Thanks so much. All right, stop on by from Minneapolis. We'll be ready.